Welcome to Thai O. Guys, uh, now I'm going to the Fu Shan Weaving Point. Fushan Weaving Point to see the pink dolphins from here but I don't think you can see without a vernacular so you definitely need it earlier a couple of hours ago I took that small boat went to the sea to find the pink dolphins but unfortunately I was not lucky to find them so either you can try to get a boat pay just $30 and then go and see or come here with the monocular and then try your luck <laughs> wow it's so beautiful here so beautiful I sweat a lot <laughs> nobody here everybody in the Thai village market Nobody here You can see the beautiful South China Sea from here This is absolutely beautiful From here you can see the South China Sea and then the world longest sea crossing bridge going to Macau and then these beautiful mountains amazing so guys uh, if you are coming to Thai O don't miss this place so if you want to come here it is a small hiking trail behind the village where the direction shows to the Thai Po Heritage Hotel or the old Thai Po Police Station from that direction you walk around 5-10 minutes and then you will see the path to the uh, hiking trail and then it's just around 15 minutes hike you see this amazing beautiful view this view is incredible amazing you can see this those beautiful greenery mountains I'm just going this direction now because I want to take a closer look on the uh, the bridge so this bridge going to Macau from Hong Kong and then from Macau to China the world longest sea crossing bridge Thai O Heritage Hotel uh, it was a former police station and built in uh, 1902 and then after 2012 it was converted to a, as a Thai O Heritage Hotel I think if you want to run away from the busiest city into this uh, beautiful uh, village take a ferry or take a bus you can spend really a nice calm weekend but it will be really challenging also because uh, this hotel in high demand book in advance so I'm not going to go inside the hotel to take a look guys this place is a paradise for photographers So they exactly uh, around 6, 6 30 they are closing down the whole market in Hong Kong the other part of the Hong Kong the shops are open till late midnight at least 10 11 12 so here 6 6 30 
all the shops are closing down. With so much to do in a such a small village, no wonder why it is most one of the most attractive tourist destination in Hong Kong. If you travel alone or if you go with the guided tour, just make sure you don't miss this Venus of Hong Kong. Guys, if you are coming here, go to Tung Chung MTR station and then find the bus number 11. That bus will directly come to the village. It will take around 50 minutes from the bus terminal. You just need to walk around 2-3 minutes and then you can enter the village. If you need such a relaxing, amazing day in Hong Kong, a day trip, you definitely need to come to Thai or Fashion Village.